I have a price list for some tools. Some of these tools have a unique price. Some other tools share the same exact price. My goal is to create a report that shows a list of products having a unique price and those products having a duplicate price. So the concept of the solution is to start counting the price column, comparing the price of each product to the entire list of prices. I'll be doing that by using a COUNTIF function. I type equal count if, I select the entire list, and then comma, I compare it to the entire list. When I close the bracket and then I hit enter, whenever the product has a unique price, I get one. But if we have a duplicate price, I get two. Then I want to create my report using a filter function. I'll be using two filter functions, one to extract the products where the count is one, and another one to extract the product name where the count is greater than one. I'll be doing that in cell F1, and I'll be combining the two filter functions in one single let function. The let function allows me to create variables and store values for these variables. I type equal let, and then I hit tab. My first variable will be A, comma, and it will store the list of product names. I select the entire list from A2 to A18. I type comma, alt, enter. My second variable will be B. I type a comma, and B will be storing the price. I select the price column from B2 to B18. I type comma, alt, enter. My third variable will be my count if function. I'll be naming it C, comma, count if, and then I hit tab. I want to count the variable B, comparing it to the same variable B. I close the bracket, I type comma, and then Alt Enter, and here comes my filter function. And because I have more than one single filter function, then I put them side by side using an edge stack function. Edge stack, and then I hit tab. My first filter function will filter the tool's name A, comma, if C is greater than one. And then comma, my second filter function will filter A, comma, and I want to include the names if C equals one. I close the bracket for the filter for the edge stack and for the let function, where I hit enter. Then I get a list of products with a duplicate price in column F and products with unique price in column G. But I have two issues here. I want to add column headers and I want to omit the NA error. Then I put my function in the edit mode F2. I start dealing with the NA by wrapping my edge stack function in an if NA. And then I hit tab. I delete the last closing bracket. I type comma, double quote, double quote. I close the bracket for the if NA. I close the bracket for the let function. When I hit enter, now we don't see the NA error. To add the labels on top of the edge stack and filter function, then I need to use a vStack function. I click before the if and a, I type v stack, and I want to stack the labels, duplicate and unique. I type them in curly brackets in double quotation. I close the curly bracket for the duplicate and unique label. I type a comma, and now I need to take care of the closing bracket for the let function. I close the bracket and hit enter, and I would have solved the problem and created the report as I wished. Thanks for watching and see you in the next quick tip.